My name is Sibusiso Malonga. I'm an activist from Zambia. I work with the Coalition of African Lesbians. I also work with the Lotus Identity in Zambia on LGBTI rights. So the criteria that we used to make the recommendations in the group one, we looked at the regional work that's happening uh, currently. Um, we looked at the country context and then we looked at um, what the proposals were actually suggesting, were they in line with the target groups that we're targeting, um, and also the capacity of the organizations. And um, finally, we looked at how the activities were actually tying into the um, outcomes that they were proposing and how that links to the uh, the, the regional work that's happening currently. Um, one of the things that I've realized is um, when writing the proposal, sometimes we neglect to uh, give more information, flesh it up, sometimes due to the uh, to the limitation of the wording, but there are certain things that we need to bring out and there's supposed to be very clear linkages between the problem, the, the activities and the outcome. It's, this process has told me that, that I should be critical in how I write my proposals and make sure that the critical information is there. So. And then collaboration also I've realized that it's very important and linking to the work that's happening in country is also very important. You know, there's a lot of work that needs to be done and there's just very little money. So it's also pressure on um, people who fundraise as well. My comment on lesbian and trans organizing in the region is that I feel it is starting up and it's, it's, it's something that's growing now. Um, it's, it's a known fact that um, gay organizing has progressed far much further than lesbian and trans organizing. But I feel that there's some work that's starting to happen and in, in the region and that's just so encouraging at this point.